Welcome back to Local 5 Live. This Memorial Day, we honor those who served our country. For many of us, we think about World War II, or currently in Iraq or Afghanistan. But the history of service goes back to the beginning of our country, and there's a lot to learn at Heritage Hill today for their event, A Soldier's Remembrance. And Steve Singstock joins us this morning to talk more about that. Good morning, Steve. Yes, good morning. Welcome to Heritage Hill. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. It looks you. gorgeous behind you there, too. Let's talk a little bit about A Soldier's Remembrance. What are the plans this Memorial Day if folks stop by Heritage Hill? I think the best thing to, to think about is we're celebrating the real meaning behind Memorial Day. So when people are here, it's a chance for them to stop and remember our many servicemen and women who uh, provided service to the country as they served in the various armed force branches. You have a whole bunch of things going on, um, from speeches and poems to people dressed in period costumes. Can you talk a little bit about what people who come to Heritage Hill today will experience? Sure, you bet. We're going to have our traditional uh, uh, remembrance at the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. Uh, there is, that's going to be done by members of the American Legion Post 11, uh, Sullivan Walden, and the American Legion Auxiliary Post 11, Sullivan Alden, and our own Heritage Hill Fort Howard Guard. Um, and they perform a ceremony uh, starting at 10 a.m. Uh, there's going to be an opening prayer, uh, and then eventually there will be a release of doves by Wings of the Heart and a 21-gun rifle salute by the American Legion Post 11. So a lot to do. After that ceremony, we'll be moving down into the park for other activities. One of the things that I saw, too, that you guys are doing is there's going to be roses available for families, too. Explain what that's all about. Sure, you bet. Uh, this is something new for this year. We've got a group here today called uh, Memorial Day Flower Foundation, and you can purchase uh, roses, which we did to salute Memorial Day with, uh, and salute our veterans. Uh, visitors here, while they last, can come and collect a free long stem rose, and we invite them to lay those at the to Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, or they may want to take them home and put them on the grave in remembrance of, say, a family member or a friend that might have been a veteran. How wonderful. This is a real teaching moment or teaching day, uh, particularly for young people, as to why we have Memorial Day. Absolutely. In fact, that's what the whole event is about. Um, I should add that uh, from the Memorial Day Flower Foundation, for the 250 flowers that we'll be distributing today, there will be another 150 flowers placed on graves at Arlington National Cemetery. Oh, awesome. So that's wow. even more of a kind of contribution there. Mm -hmm. And you encourage folks to, to share those, uh, those moments, too, if they want, on email or social media to be able to get a scene of where those roses have gone throughout the area, correct? Absolutely. And I should remind everyone that today's event is free, so everyone is welcome to come, collect a rose while they last, and just enjoy the park. The weather's clearing up, and it actually is going to be quite nice. <laughs> yeah. Perhaps uh -huh. a little windy, but we do encourage people to come out because it's a wonderful day here at Heritage Hill. You know, the wind is great for those flags, so we don't <laughs> mind that, do we? <laughs> we want to see that. Right. We, we want to see old glory moving. All Absolutely. Right. Look, give us the details on the when this is taking place. What time of the day is this going to be open to the public? Well, we're going to be opening the gates at 10 o'clock, and we'll immediately commence with the uh, remembrance at the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. Uh, there'll be some music, some singing, and after the ceremony is completed, we'll move into the park for other activities. All right. Sounds like it's going to be a good time. Thank you so much, Steve, for joining us there at Heritage Hill. We'll check back in there at the location in just a little bit. Thanks, Steve. Thank you very much for having us on the show this morning. Absolutely. Absolutely. You're welcome. Still ahead.